Hello and welcome to this week's Pause for Prayer. I'd like to talk to you all today about blessing prayers, about the idea of blessing everyday objects. Uh, frequently, as a pastor, people will come to me and bring me some object that's important to them and ask me to bless it. And at first, this was something new to me. It, it's not part of the tradition that I grew up in or was familiar with. I'd blessed babies and blessed people's homes before, but never something like a cross or a pendant or a prayer uh, rosary or something like that. But I've come to really value this practice as an understanding that God cares about ordinary, everyday objects. And somehow the, the blessing isn't magical. It doesn't endow the ordinary gift with any special powers or anything like that in my understanding. But it does remind us of the holiness in everyday life and the holiness in all the things around us, all the things that we touch, all the things that we use in our work, in our play, in our daily living, all of those things God cares about and God offers a blessing over. Well, how about this particular object? This is one of my new face masks. I have been given some beautiful face masks made by a member of our own congregation who's been volunteering to do so at St. Mary's uh, Hospital. And these ones are very precious, not, because, not just because they're beautiful, but because they were made by her hands. And it feels to me like they already came to me endowed with a blessing because of the work that she put into sewing them and the fact that me and my family can wash them and reuse them and uh, practice good health for the earth and good health for our neighbors as we wear them when we go out into the community. But just this week, a friend and colleague of mine, Mary Ludy, published through the Pilgrim Press a, a blessing for face masks, a way for us to pray a blessing into these new everyday objects that are becoming a part of our life every time we leave the house, I hope, for you that you are making that a part of your habit as you go into public spaces here in London and get on the tube and all of those new things that we're just beginning to do here. So I thought today for a particular prayer of blessing, I would share with you uh, Dr. Ludi's prayer of blessing for a face mask. I'm going to hold my face masks in my hand as I pray this prayer. And you can pray a prayer of blessing for the things in your home, or maybe you can get your face masks and share in this blessing prayer as well. Let us pray. God of health and wholeness, of neighbor love and kindness, bless these masks, a slight shield against great ills. Bless the fabric that repels the drop, the ties that go behind my ears, the wire that fits snug against my nose, the fold that cups my chin. Make me grateful for my mask, even when it makes me hot, even when I look funny in it, even when I'm dying to take it off. Bless me also, and everyone, who for their own and others' sakes put on this holy inconvenience every day, our minds made up to love. Amen. May the objects in your life be blessed. As you wear your face masks, may you know God's presence in these ordinary gestures of love that we do to protect one another. God bless.